I got a notch. I got a good back cut. Started sitting down on the bar a little bit. I got a pulley. I know guys, you're not supposed to use a pulley because it'll smash the pulley when it falls, but we'll risk it. We got one side tied to a tree. We got the other side tied to Garrett. That's two to one. <laughs> no, <laughs> we gave ourselves going back to the tree. That's going to be three to one. Okay. See right here. So if we were to pull on this, we're three to one. Okay. But we put a pulley here on an Alpine butterfly and therefore we have one, two, three, four to one. Okay, so it'd be the same as if we had a double pulley up there, but we don't. We have it down here instead. So let's get in line with this right here. Take advantage of the full mechanical advantage here. All right, so let me go back. It's moving. <laughs> Come on, old man. All right, we're going to cut a tiny bit more. Pull it. <laughs> it's opening up. All right, let me cut more. Hold on. You guys can see this has a nice hard lean going back. It's probably a thousand pounds. It takes the added force of breaking the wood. So whenever you have a couple inches of wood and the tree isn't helping you break it, that's why it's so hard to pull. So he's got the four to one. The guy weighs like 120, right? Is that right? 110. And we got a very thin space right here. So I'm expecting Garrett will be able to pull this over now with that four to one. So go ahead and give it to her, Garrett. Come on, you're advancing, you're advancing. Yup, you got it, now it's all yours. 